Alright everybody, welcome back to Pokemon Gold. Uh, it's a little bit of lag. I don't know what's causing that. Like, I don't, usually don't have the problem. But it's just going to be one of those days where the internet's just not playing fun. Alright. Um, <clears throat> we've been to the Pokemon Center. I haven't done much grinding. I said I would. I jumped straight back into the next episode. <laughs> Went downstairs, had a quick bite to eat. Alright, so we'll go and we'll get rid of Jin. Don't need Jin. Alright! Whoa! Ha! Reloading! Uh, change uh, mood Pokemon with. Yes. Yes, I forget about this. That's not what I want. Uh, deposit Pokemon. Gin. Boys. Yes. Alright. So we're going to just, uh, I guess, jump straight on in. <clears throat> into the battle with Faulkner? Is that here? Who knows? Who knows? I even tried turning my wireless headset off to see if that would help me. What's actually a smart idea is to go past Faulkner. Oh, good god, that's so bad. What's happening? I should really have this up displayed. Yeah. Yeah, drop. Poison Kilberry! <laughs> Before it actually got a real name. Love old school Pokemon stuff. I, yeah, because usually when I do this, this just starts happening. I can't even see why it's happening, like, unless it's you, you interfering? See if turning that phone off is the, going to fix it. Because I just had a f spare phone that I was charging on my desk. Wow, this is bad. Most of the time. Why are you dropping like 70 packets? And you don't 7. What is going on, guys? What is up? I don't know. It's all, it's, it seems fixed now. Fixed dish. Fixed for now. Um, let's call it that. Uh, you used to be able to go. Or is that just in the new ones? That you go down here and you pick up a. Okay. Yeah, no, I don't know what's going on with the internet right now, or the network. Because this network should just connect from my DS directly to my PC. Oh well, I guess we'll do our best to continue on with our lives. Or we drop packets. Because the thing is, when you're doing this, you really don't want to drop any packets. That's, that's, all, you're, that's all you want. I'm gonna try and fix it between this episode and next, because it shouldn't. If I, it honestly shouldn't be happening. Like the network is a total of like a meter long. <laughs> wow, I really should have trained. Does not look like we'll be doing a lot, guys. I know how I said, but uh, didn't expect this guy to be so hard. I'm gonna go pack potion use on seal. I also really should have healed Frank. <laughs> in hindsight, hindsight is a twenty twenty. Oh, don't have sound. Sorry guys, my bad. I turned it off when I was going to train, but I didn't want to train. Sorry. I know, I know, mistakes were seriously made this episode. Gain some... We get a grill level 9, that's going to help us a little. Halfway to level 10. Bird Keeper A. Oh, is that... He only, he only had one Pokemon, that's why it was level 9. 
Looks like we are not dropping any packets anymore, so that is fortunate for us. It's also really weird because I'd, I'm, half the time I want to look at my computer screen because the screen, it's, it's physically bigger than the uh, DS, but the problem with that is that it, uh, it lags a little, so there's a bit of a delay. But you, it's too expe to be expected. Like. I have no problem there being delay, that's why I sync up my audio at the start. If you don't know, I just say 1, 2, 3 and just sort of open the menu and go 1, 2, 3 at the same time. It's really, really high tech. Ooh, we're dropping packets again. That was 21. Back down to 0. So, <clears throat> that's not the thing I should be commentating on. I should be uh, better than all the peoples. Hey, man. Ooh, there's a there's a oh, there's a cave over here, right? You can catch a geodude in here, I think. Uh, you require a flash, apparently. Wow, this is quite the long. Didn't mean to walk back out. See, so I catch a geodude. Geodude. Ooh, can I get that? I um, probably can't. It's probably too far. But if I can catch a Pokemon in here, hopefully, I think if they have a cave, right, that there'd be a... Oh, there we go. That's a really horrible geo, dude. Uh, very average. <clears throat> How annoying. But I'm going to learn. We're going to try and catch, like, a Geodude or Onyx, because if we got a Rock-type Pokemon... So we're not doing another one. It's been decided. I've already caught two Pokemon on the first route. I mean, I could have released one, but... You know. You know. Uh, we're just going to... Try and catch a rock type. Oh, rock ground, obviously. But try. Do our best. Do what we can. So, uh, I, I remember when I was in primary school, back in the day. Uh, so, I think primary, primary school is the first, uh, first type of school you go to in Australia. Um, that's secondary school or high school. And then university. Um... <clears throat> So, in primary school, when we're hanging out, we're all playing Pokemon together. I almost had finished the, uh, the Pokedex in that game. Because what I would do is, uh, there's the cloning glitch. Whew, you are very interesting. That's actually not a bad Geodude, in all in all. Because, uh, Geodude doesn't need a high special attack, because he's a physical attacker, so... Makes sense. Um, and what I, there was a cloning glitch, and I borrowed my friend's Pokemon. I'm like, oh yeah, just just lend them to me for a little while, and um, well, I don't want to go do that. Uh, and I'll just clone them and give them back to you. I do that repetitively. It's not very effective. Eh? I do that repetitively until I got like two something. I was in the high two hundreds, heading towards um. Uh, I mean, high, higher end of the Pokedex, heading towards having all the all the Pokemon. So, uh, yeah, I think I almost finished the Pokedex. So one of the things I always wanted to do is uh, play Pokemon Yellow or something, and then finish the Pokedex in that, and then go up to the next game, and then finish the Pokedex by copying all my moving all my Pokemon over to Yellow from Yellow, which we can do um, now. But I think the, the challenge I wanted to do was uh, get all the Pokemon in the Pokedex without getting, like, with only having to swap, like, if I really needed to trade Pokemon, using, like, glitches to get all the Pokedex, so I didn't have to, uh, they would all be in one game. I always wanted to do that as, like, a challenge for myself. Uh, that would be fun. I'd enjoy that. Uh, pack. Now we use the Pokeball, not before we weaken it. Once, twice, three times. Yes, gotcha, Geodude. Uh, what do you call him, Geodude? Um, yeah, we give him a nickname. Uh, what's his? What are we thinking? What are we thinking? Lenny. No other reason that just popped into my head. 
Lenny. Alright, now we can escape the cave we are in. Alrighty then. So we'll do some grinding, because uh, we kind of have to, because we're seriously in... Well, that's an interesting... I don't know, just looking at the stats as they come up, like, I, I don't know, I just find it personally just interesting. Kind of cool at the same time. <laughs> Ooh, water. Uh, the hidden power typing, I did the work on that. Um, I did the work on, like, the colouring, the colour combinations and stuff. So I, uh, select, I got a, um, what did I get? I got a... <laughs> We got a Pokemon Crystal sprite map to work out the typings. I only used the sprite map, and then I used the hex codes, and it was it was a very long and extensive work. It was it was actually pretty good. Uh, I think you'll even find that the fire color for the bottom and the fire color for the HP when it's zero is actually different, not the same. Because I didn't use the, the the normal. I used the color like the hex code from the sprite map, not the the thing. It was actually a lot of fun. I had so much fun setting it up. Um, so I think it's... I can't remember how it works. Because um, I'm, I'm not looking at the code or anything, so just off the top of my head, it's like... It uses an equation to work out a number, and then it uses that number as the, um, the typing. And the typing correlates to and the number on another piece of code. So the color and the, the the word, they're both like five, and I've just set them up in the like, like the order. It's actually pretty fun. Um, the code is kind of tacky, but some of the code has been revamped. Uh, Shadow of Darkness did a lot of the work on the code between for the update for the official releases. And he cut it down by 21 offsets. So we were keeping track of like 21 locations in RAM. And he cut it down by... T no, we were keeping track of over 21. He cut away 21 offsets. And so the DS has to take... Like, monitor where all those locations are. And it's taking a processing power. So this is the leanest version of the code. Which is actually really good. Good work uh, to show of darkness. Good work. Uh, I haven't actually done any of the work on the update for this version. Um, my contribution is actually this series. <laughs> Beta testing the code. Um, and trying to fix like the, the bugs. So you actually, if, I, if I, we run into bugs on camera, I'm actually going to have to sit down and try and fix them. <laughs> Which is actually going to be amusing, and then I'm going to update it straight away when we find stuff. Um, I just thought it'd be fun to beta test something on camera at the same time. Oh, oh so if you press, if you're holding B, you can't open the menu? Only if you press the menu by itself. I think I know why that is, it's to open up uh, the roaming ones. These ones. Uh, not those ones. The roaming ones because they, they're waiting for like a button combo so if you already have a button combo um, it's not working I think that's a desired uh, not a desired thing but it's a unforeseen side effect of another piece of the game um, which is fine that's fine that's not bug right what are we up against here <clears throat> uh, highest stat there is special which is uh, no good for us it's not a good bell sprout. So yeah, beta testing a piece of software on camera. Just for a bit of fun. <coughs> Cyril? Go away safely. So my plan is to record a number of episodes. I shouldn't be running away from these Pokemon. What am I doing? I'm meant to be training. Ooh, dragon type hidden power. I can't wait to get hidden power in this. Like knowing the hidden power type is just going to make it so awesome. I'm going to be trading. I've been um, running away from all, all the battles. Like, what am I doing? Ah, uh, that is super effective. I know why. Because oh, oh, mistakes are just made. 
Oh well, oh well, oh well. He's fine with again. Yeah, here's the problem. I'm gonna have to go scratch. Oh, thankfully that Leer just helped me out that little bit more. Okay, we are going to go. <clears throat> Ooh, what a fancy caterpillar. Nah, not as good as the other one there. Not as good as the other one. Which is fine. What's interesting about these uh, virtual consoles is, the games is they um, they make it so that uh, moves that were previously not easy to get a hold of are now easier to get a hold of. So this it changes uh, competitive quite a lot, actually. Quite a lot. But I'm going to call it here for this episode. Uh, next time, I think we'll do a little bit more grinding. I'm leaning towards that. I might do a little bit off camera, but don't hold your breath. Um, so I'll see you then. Sign.